this is my new tank setup. It has a un it has a underground under gravel filter. Um, it's 29 gallons. I just bought it earlier this week. I just got air all of the equipment yesterday, and I set it up last night. It's been running for about 12 hours. Um, filled it up with cold water because it's 90 degrees out here today. And I figured might as well just fill it up with cold water. So letting it run a little bit so the chlorine can like evaporate. It's been running for 12 hours so I'm pretty sure it's safe. The reason the water color is kind of tinted blue is because I put a little bit of plant fertilizer in there. Um, and I do love this color, so I don't know if I'm going to be using food coloring just to diet this color. I really do like this color. Um, I don't know if it's safe to put food coloring, especially since I'm going to be using um, neocaridium shrimps, red cherry shrimps in there. But yeah, I love how it looks. Um, so the plan is I put fertilizer in there because I am going to get plants today. And I plan to just throw them in here. I don't want to throw them inside this tank, which is the 48 gallon, and I don't want to throw it inside that one or this one. This one is infested by uh, hair algae. And this one, I haven't even had the bubbles running until last night. Oh, last night is when I got this this air pump, which is able to fill all these things with air pretty good air pump um yeah so anyways i'm gonna be throwing the plants in here just in case they have pests or something at least i get to see it before i distributed the one as a tank so today the plant that i'm gonna be getting is guppy grass and anacharis my two favorite plants well hornwort is my first favorite but honestly hornwort is kind of messy so I'm hoping guppy grass grows fast and that could be my new favorite um, after these two plants get here sometime this week hopefully my dwarf Sagittaria plant will come and I'm just plant it in the substrate oh and as soon as these plants get here I'm trying to like prolong it but as soon as these plants get here I'm gonna be grabbing some of that substrate and just covering the top or mixing it a little bit on the top just to help seed this tank I don't know how healthy this substrate is but I'm sure it has good bacteria that can serve in this tank so that's what I'll be doing plus that has crushed curl crush coral which is going to be needed for my shrimps when they do come into this tank very excited I think this is going to make for a great shrimp tank great planted shrimp tank and we'll see